Hello everyone and welcome to Lost Gear. This is Rahul talking to you about automotive stuff. So, so today we are going to learn how to drive an automatic car. I had recently faced a similar problem where I couldn't drive an automatic car. So today I am going to show you guys how to drive an automatic car. So let's go. So the car I would be driving is a Skoda Rapid. And when you enter, okay so <coughs> So first the pedals, there are only two pedals That's the brake pedal and that's the accelerator pedal And Okay, so let's close the door Okay, coming up to the stick shift So there are different modes over here That's the park mode The reverse mode, the neutral mode, drive mode and S Sport mode Which stands for sport mode the different driving modes uh, in the automatic are also uh, displayed on the screen such as the P for park mode, R for the reverse mode, N for neutral, D for drive and then when you shift it to manual mode, you the first gear appears over there and then you can start shifting up or down. So now to convert the car into manual mode, you can simply just move the uh, stick to the drive mode and then push it to the left and now the car turns into manual mode so you can see the first gear being displayed over here that's the I think the camera is not catching it still that's that's the gear indicator and then to upshift the gears you simply just have to move this front like that so it's like first gear second gear third gear and now to shift it shift down and now to downshift you just have to push it back so that makes it very easy to drive rather than using clutch in other cars in manual cars so first let us switch off the car first before starting the car make sure that uh, you are in the park mode that is simply done by holding this button over here and then shifting it to park mode and then hold press the brake pedal and then turn on the vehicle so couple of points about the automatic mode always bring the car to a complete halt when uh, when you want to shift from the drive mode to the reverse mode and similarly in the, from the dry, uh, reverse mode to the drive mode make sure the car is completely stopped the second point is uh, even whenever you want to put the car to the park mode make sure that the car is completely stopped always make sure to uh, lift the handbrake when you are in the park mode because sometimes uh, the park mode doesn't work so that's it and now to drive just hold this button press this button and then you can shift so now I'm in reverse mode so the car goes reverse then neutral mode and then drive mode so now I'm in the drive mode. After engaging in the drive mode, you can uh, release the brake and then accelerate gradually, slowly. Because if you are driving it for the first time, uh, I suggest you to accelerate slowly till you get the hang of the car. And then coming up to S mode. S mode is used in highways when you want to go a bit more fast compared to the city speed limits. So yeah, that's that's about the different. Uh, the modes in automatic cars okay guys so now i'm going to start the car i've put i've kept my right foot on the left uh, pedal that is the brake pedal and then i've put the car into the park mode and let's release the handbrake and start the car and now we shall press this button and put the lever to the drive mode and then leave the brake pedal so the car sta starts moving okay wait what the heck is this guy up to okay now we leave the brake pedal the car stop starts moving since it's a slope Okay, a bit of advice over here, don't be hard on the brake, initially it gives a very strong response till you get used to the car. So yeah, now we slowly gradually press the accelerator. 
when the car starts moving gently so the automatic mode is more preferable for city roads city traffic and all it feels very comfortable no problem of changing the gears pressing the clutch you can aram se cruise in the city roads So now we'll shift to the manual mode. So now we are in the first gear and then second just and then we shift to third. Yeah. No problem of shifting or uh, pressing the clutch at all. Now since arriving at the hump I'm supposed to downshift I believe. Yes, downshifting, downshifting. Oopsie. Upshifting. Yeah, that's how you drive it in the manual mode. So yeah, that's it. So if, if you guys have enjoyed watching this video or if you guys have learned something from this video, please hit the like and the subscribe button below. Thanks for watching and I'll catch up with the next one.